In this video, I will show you how to make a YouTube banner in Canva. And if this video does help you out today, please consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like on the video, and also subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. With that being said, let's jump straight into the tutorial. So here we are, I'm currently on canva.com. Now from the homepage, you can see down here, we've actually got the YouTube banner showing. Now, if this is not showing for any reason, what you can do is come to this search box here and you can go ahead and type YouTube banner into here. Now, if you want, you can actually niche down a bit more as well. So if you're, if for example, you wanted to do a YouTube banner in the music niche, then you could put like um, music YouTube banner and you'll see in the suggested results, we're gonna get this music YouTube banner. So what you're gonna to want to do is go ahead and give that a click. And what it's gonna do is actually bring up some pre-made templates. So you can actually use this as a basis and you can kind of put your own spin on it. Or if you just want to start from scratch, you can go ahead and click this, create a blank music YouTube banner. So once you've chosen your template, or if you are starting from scratch, what it's going to do is take you into the editor, which is actually going to look like this. Now, what I'm gonna do is just select one of these templates from the left-hand side. So I'm gonna go for this one. And what you can do from here is very, very easy. This is actually scaled to fit the YouTube banner. So you don't need to worry about reducing the picture size or anything like that. And what you can do, there's a ton of things you can do with this. So you've got the text obviously, and you can add more text by coming to the left-hand side. This is your main menu. So you've got the text option here and you can click one of these. So you can add like a heading, a smaller bit of text. And there's actually some pre-made font combinations down here. So you can actually choose any of these pre-made combinations if you want to, just to give you a bit more of a head start and a professional look to your channel. So for example, I could choose this one and I could call it like um, Tech Tutor. And of course you've got the option to change your color. This is all at the top of the page. So when you've got something selected, you've got the toolbar for that certain item. So for this bit of text, if I wanted to change your color, I would come up here and of course change the color from here. So I could change it to like a blue color, like so. And you can do things like add effects, you can add like a glow to it, you can add an outline. Yeah, there's a ton of different things you can do. Um, in terms of images, what you can do, you can actually upload your own images by coming to the uploads option here and you can upload files off your computer. What you can also do is come up to the elements tab here and you can actually search for different elements which are free to use on Spotify. So this can be anything you want really. So for example, a music based one, I could put like radio and you can see we've got graphics, which are kind of like clip art style pictures of a radio, or we've got actual photos of a radio here. So of, of course you free to use any of these for your YouTube banner to add anything onto this template. All you want to do is just simply click onto the picture. So if I go back onto the graphics, Say I wanted to add to this one, for example, what you wanna do is give it a click and that's gonna pop it straight onto your banner for you. From here, you can go ahead and adjust the size. And again, you can do all sorts of things like edit the image, the colors, and so on and so forth. So once you've created your banner and you're happy with everything, what you're gonna to want to do is come up to the top right hand corner to this share button, go ahead and give that a click and then click onto download to download your finished banner. So it's gonna ask what file type, and I would recommend PNG as this is the best for this style, but you do have other formats as well, like for example, JPEG or uh, PDF. And once you've chosen this, of course, just go ahead and click the purple download button here, and that's gonna start downloading your design. So I hope this quick tutorial helped you out today and gave you a basic introduction on how to create a YouTube banner using Canva. And if it did help you out today, as I say, I'd really appreciate it if you did drop down below the video, left a like, and also considered subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you in the next tutorial.